Here you see an universal milling machine Galmatic from the German manufacturer Prechtel in the town of Birkenau. This machine can do quite powerful milling operations, sometimes, an automatic feed especially for the x-axis is quite useful. The up to now solution used a DC motor with 3 nanometers torque. This torque was in some milling operations a bit too low. Now we'll mount a NEMA 34 stepper motor with 8 nanometers. Now the C programs and the circuit diagram follow. An LCD display shows the speed of the X spindle. It is connected via the I2C bus. Since this bus is very slow, a second Arduino is used to display the speed, which is triggered by the first Arduino. This main Arduino doesn't have to be a Mega 2560, a Uno will do too, or a Nano 2. I plan the Mega to connect a display directly without an I2C bus for speed reasons. But then the tangled cables bothered me. A second Arduino is easier. This is the second Arduino that drives the LCD display. I am working with two interrupts. Since the display is only triggered once per second, they do not interfere. Both Arduinos are coupled via a 4N35 optocoupler. It doesn't necessarily have to, but it doesn't hurt either. The motor driver is set to 1600 pulses per revolution.
now the electrically much simpler solution with a DC motor and worm gear. For this we need a clutch, otherwise manual operation is not possible. Otherwise we only need a simple switch and a powerful laboratory power supply. Back to the stepper motor solution, I don't like the LCD display, it is also placed in an unfavorable position. Now a 4 character LED display with a TM1637 module is to be connected. The circuit diagram remains as it is, only A4 with SCA and A5 with SCL are omitted. They are replaced by D4 on CLK and D5 on DIO. The conversion factor is 60 divided by 1600 pulses per revolution, this makes 0 0.0375. A plastic box that once contained magnets is converted into a display. The display Arduino is now placed here. As before, revolutions of the spindle per minute are displayed directly. Compared to the DC motor solution, we have the advantage of a much wider speed range with high torque. This is currently the lowest speed, 6 revolutions per minute. But that can easily be changed by adjusting the number of pulses per revolution on the stepper motor driver. Of course, the conversion factor must then be adjusted in the Arduino display program.
that is 1,600 pulses per revolution. This is currently the highest speed, around 220 revolutions per minute as rapid traverse.